Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Today, Cheryl and I are gonna address one subject that actually kind of drives us crazy. It's just because we hear about it every single day. And we know the benefits of this particular subject. That subject is women and weight training. We're not even talking about heavy weight training. We're just talking about weight training in general. So right. we're gonna knock this out today. I hope you guys enjoy it. So the one thing that we've noticed over the years of training is that women just do not want to lift heavy weights. Now, I can't really figure this out. I don't understand it. I'm not a woman, but I do hear every single solitary day that they don't want to get big and bulky. They're afraid to pick up heavy weights because they just can't do it and they're just afraid they're going to end up looking like a guy. So we're going to address that as well. But with me being a guy, my mindset is completely, totally different. Cheryl has her own story. She now lifts heavy, but she used to not lift heavy. But I'll tell you this much, when she started to pick up the heavy weights, her entire body changed. We're gonna go ahead and talk about this and hopefully we can persuade some women to go ahead and pick up those heavy dumbbells. When you first started your exercise journey, right. I'm sure you are in the gym, going for those fives, okay, maybe the Okay, I wasn't tens. even lifting weights. Oh, not even lifting weights. No, in the beginning of my <laughs> fitness journey. Okay. Join the gym. Join the gym. I was in the cardio section the whole time. Really? The whole time? The whole time. Wow. The whole hour and a half, maybe, that uh -huh. I was there thinking I was getting in a good workout. Yeah, your heart was pounding. Right. All sweaty. Okay. Right. So it took me a while um, to pick up weights. Uh, mostly. It was in classes mm -hmm. that I took, which uh, introduced me to the weights. Um, I picked up small weights, light weights, at first. Yeah. Uh, Were you just, just afraid? I just, just wasn't didn't... strong enough. Yeah. So you didn't the, the what it didn't go through your mind that maybe if I pick up the heavier weights I'll get stronger. Or not did you at that. Even care? Not at that point. Not in at that time. point. Okay. No, not in the beginning. Okay. So. It, I did pick up the baby weights at first, but I was working out every day. Mm -hmm. um, I, even with the baby weights, I was getting stronger from nothing to a little bit stronger. Then I would progress and pick up little heavier weights mm -hmm. to where I was, you know, doing reps and it was easy. So then that's kind of when I knew I just needed to get something a little bit heavier. Yeah, yeah. Um, and you did. I did. You did. I that's did go heavier. Yeah, good. Um, at one point in time, you know, I've had conversations with friends about uh, lifting heavier weights, and um, everyone had said and mentioned that they were scared that if they lift heavy weights, they were gonna look like the dude over there, mm -hmm. um, big and bulky, mm -hmm. which just can't happen for us. Mm -mm. Cannot can't. happen for the ladies, nope. No. Mm -hmm. um, eventually, uh, I you know, got stronger and stronger and stronger and went heavy, but what it does do, shapes your body. Shapes your body, makes you strong. Makes you stronger. Um, mm -hmm. More muscle mass you have, burns more calories. That's true. The muscle's more dense than fat. Gives you a little different shape that you want. Right, smaller dress smaller. size, but you could weigh the same, so maybe stay off the scale. No, 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 yeah. You'll just feel better, yeah. and you'll look, your clothes will fit better and different. You will notice that mm -hmm. the clothes you used to wear is, is now really loose. Yeah, yeah. And you just need to go get a new wardrobe, so it's mm -hmm. kind of like a win-win. Win -win. Yeah. yeah, that's a good problem to have, ladies. It is. Yeah. So here's one thing that I want to add to that is that the women that are big and bulky, they spend years and years and years specifically training to get big and bulky. Now that's called hypertrophy. It's not gonna happen, ladies. If you're coming to the gym, if you have an everyday life, you go to work, you take care of your kids, you take your kids to baseball practice and soccer practice, you can barely make it to the gym two to three times a week, you're not gonna get big and bulky if I ask you to pick up a heavier weight. It's just not gonna happen. These ladies that do that, trust me, they might have a little bit of help with some supplements and they're gonna be in the gym hours and hours and hours every single solitary day. The only thing that picking up the heavy weights is gonna do, it's gonna make you more functionally fit, okay. it's gonna make you stronger, 
and it's gonna make you smaller because you don't have that testosterone floating around. If you can put on one pound of muscle, one pound of muscle, you're gonna be burning three to 500 calories extra a day. Doing nothing. Doing nothing, right? But sitting at work going, which is a lot of us do. So that's the secret, guys. That's the secret. It's not on the treadmill. There's nothing wrong with cardio. You gotta do that too. But honestly, if you're really looking for that big change and to see those results, pick up the heavy dumbbells, guys. Ladies, not guys, pick up the heavy dumbbells. Not the fives, not the tens. Go for the 15s and just bump your reps down. I promise it's gonna work and it's not gonna hurt you. It's gonna only make you better. You could probably get your groceries in one trip. One trip. And with the kids. And the kids. Right. And the only reason why is because you go to the gym three days a week and you pick up a little bit heavier weights. Right. What a great benefit that is. I'm telling you, it works. Don't be afraid of the heavy weights. Cheryl's living proof. I just don't understand it because I go to the gym and I try to pick up the heaviest stupid thing I could find, or at least heavier than the guy next to me. Ladies, there, you guys just typically aren't like that, which that's how you are, and that's not a bad thing, but challenge yourself. Challenge yourself. Challenge yourself. One last question I wanna ask, is, since this is like my whole mindset here, is when I can't do something, or I think I can't do something, it kinda irritates me okay. a little bit. When you were not able to pick up the heavy weights, or when you were kind of afraid of the heavy weights, some women that come to the gym they're okay with it being that way. They're okay with being defeated. They're like, ah, I can't do that and I'm totally fine with that. Why is it okay to be defeated by something that if you just work a little harder, you can completely, totally do? For me was, uh, I was scared to fail. Mm -hmm. But failure's good failure's in the good. gym. You have to learn from it. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Um, and what, another thing is that um, I tell my kids this all the time. They tell me, like, especially with foods. Mm -hmm. I don't like that. I've never tried it. Give it a shot. Never tried it. <laughs> How do you know you don't like it? Yeah. So if you don't ever pick up something that's a little bit more heavy, a little bit more challenging, you cannot tell me you can't do it because you haven't done it. You haven't even tried. Right. Yeah. So pick up the heavier weights. Yes. And if it's only you can do like two or three reps and that's what you do. And then the next time you pick up heavier weights, the next day you might bump another rep out. And then you're just gonna get stronger and stronger and pick up heavier stuff. So here's the situation. Rule of thumb is heavier weights, lighter reps, right? So you're going with five pound dumbbells, maybe you're cranking out four sets of 25, right. not seeing those results. Right. Check this out. Grab a 15 and do four sets of eight. And it's gonna take you a little longer. It's gonna take longer. It's gonna hurt. Heavy, it's gonna be different. Right. Yes. It, yes. Your movements are gonna be a little slower. Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. So, ladies, you are not gonna get big and bulky by lifting heavy weights. You are gonna get massively strong, and your body is going to change. If you're looking for that tone, that's what's gonna get it. We gotta build that muscle. If you put on muscle, you will be burning more fat. So, please have your cardio days, but don't just have cardio days. That's not good. If you're gonna lift weights, make it count. Make it count. You're not gonna get big and bulky, but no. you're gonna get crazy strong and yep. ridiculously fit. So if you like what you hear, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Go ahead and hit the like button. We will see you very soon. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Bye. Bye.